Hello students how are you all today we are going to study a new chapter our state our pride lesson number 25 from your class 4 evs textbook in this chapter you are going to learn to locate karnataka on the map of india you will be learning physical divisions of karnataka state and you will be able to recognize the historical and famous natural resorts of a state and develop an attitude to protect them by knowing their importance so let us begin so students tell me which is our country india is our country right so a country is a area which has states together isn't it many states form a country similarly many district form a state you have learnt about states of our country so now tell me how many states are there in india there are 28 states and eight union territories in our country now with the help of this map let us write the names of states of india andhra pradesh arunachal pradesh assam bihar chatisgarh goa gujarat haryana himachal pradesh Jammu and Kashmir, Jharkhand, Karnataka, Kerala, Madhya Pradesh, Maharashtra, Manipur, Meghalaya, Mizoram, Nagaland, Orissa. Punjab, Rajasthan, Sikkim, Tamil Nadu, Telangana, Tripura, Uttar Pradesh, Uttarakhand and West Bengal. These are Twenty-eight states of our country. Dear students, now tell me where Karnataka is located in the map of India. The direction in which Karnataka is situated in the map of India is south. So Karnataka is located in the south direction. Which is our state? Karnataka is our state and you know that there are 30 districts in our state isn't it there are 30 districts in our state now each state has special physical feature for example some will be covered by hills some are coastal areas etc now you have already learned about physical features in a, in your previous class isn't it So now let us learn about more details about physical features of our state that is how Karnataka is divided into four physical states okay so first one is western coastal region also known as the coastal plain second one malnad region third one northern plains and the last one is southern plains now let us learn one by one in detail first we are going to study details about western coastal region the western coastal region is the area along the arabian sea on the west of the state western coastal region is also called as konkana coast this area is about 240 kilometers in length karwar mangalore and udupi are the main cities of this region iron and manganese are the main minerals of this region now let us learn about few wild animals found in this region land animals such as bat 
जंगल फाव वाइल्ड बोर उडपेक एंड एक्वाटिक एनिमल सच एस प्राउंस सी क्रैप फिशेस स्टार फिश आर फाउंड हियर वेस्टर्न कोस्टल रीजन इज अ हेवी रेनफॉल एरिया फिशरी इज द मेन ऑक्यूपेशन ऑफ दिस रीजन पैडी कोकोनट अरेकनट कैशुनट आर द इम्पॉर्टेंट क्रॉप्स ड्रैक फ्रूट मैंगो नंदी honne are the main trees found here this is all about the western coastal region now we are going to study about the second division that is malnad region madikeri chikamagaluru shivamogga hasan and belagavi are the main cities of this region we find iron ore and manganese ore in malnad region bison deer tiger elephant wild rat and rare species like splendor loris are found here agriculture is the main occupation of the people paddy black pepper beetle leaves arachnid cardamom tea coffee and spices are the major crops found here malnad region is a heavy rainfall area we find evergreen forest in this region sandalwood honne silk cotton tree jackfruit hebbalasu rosewood are the main trees found in this region This region consists of ranges of western ghats it is also called sayadri it is about 400 km in length now we are going to study about the third division that is northern plains bidar kalaburgi darwar hubballi gadag Vijayapura Raichur Ballari Bagalkote Koppala are the main cities of this region Copper limestone iron and gold are the main minerals found in this region monitor lizard garden lizard snakes wolf fox and mongoose are the wild animals found in this region agriculture is the main occupation of the region wheat jowar bajra millet tobacco groundnut sugar cane and various oil seeds are the major crops of this region this area is a low rainfall area shrubs thorns babble tree elephant apple gooseberry soapnut tree are the main trees of this region 
this region is 350 to 600 meters above the sea level it is a plain land this is all about northern plains now we are going to study about southern plains Davangere, Tumkur, Chitradurga, Mandya, Chamarajanagara, Kolara, Mysuru and Bangalore are the main cities of this area. Mica, Slate, Limestone, and granite are the main minerals found in this region. Wolf, bear, monkey, peacock, black buck are found here. Agriculture and dairy farming are the main occupations of the people here. Ragi, Paddy, pulses, cotton, sesame are the major crops. Southern Plains is a low rainfall area. Rosewood, Nandi, Teakwood, Honne are the main trees found here. This area is 600 to 1000 meters above the sea level and it is more of hills and slopes there are many places of attraction in our state thousands of tourists visit our state every year now let us study few places of attractions of our state bengaluru is the capital city of our state vidhana sauda high court Vishveshwaraya Museum, Tipu Summer Palace, Jawaharlal Nehru Planetarium, Lal Park, and Kabban Park are the main places of attraction here. Mysore Palace, Chamundi Hills, Mysore Zoo are the important places in Mysore. The Sara celebration held here is famous all over the world. Children, observe this picture. What comes to your mind when you see this picture? This is a picture of famous stone chariot of Hampi. Hampi is in Ballari district. It was the capital city of Vijayanagara Empire. The architecture of this place is very famous. The carvings of Virupaksha temple, Lotus Mahal are very beautiful. Children, have you visited any hill stations? Nandi Hills, Baba Budangiri, Mullayanagiri, Kemmanagundi, Kudurimuk, Kodachadri are the important hill stations of our state. People visit hill stations because of their cool weather and beautiful nature. There are beautiful beaches in Ullal, Mangalore, Malpe and Karavara. Joke Falls of Shivamogga district Shivana Samudra of Mandya district, Goka Falls of Belagavi district are very beautiful. Wildlife sanctuaries of Bandipura, Nagarahole and bird sanctuaries of Ranganathittu, Kokkare Belluru are main places of attraction for the people. River Kaveri takes its birth at Silla Kaveri of Brahmagiri Hills in Kodagu district. Bengaluru is famous for information technology, so it is called as Silicon City. In Asia, the first electricity generating station was established in 1902 
at Shivana Samudra of Mandya district. St. Mary's Island of Western Coastal Region has the octagon-shaped structures. Hampi and Pattadakallu, the historical places of Karnataka, are in the list of World Heritage Sites. Dear children, our state has been recognized as an important state in the country by its various characters. So, we must be proud of our rich and beautiful state. The natural landscape of Karnataka adds beauty to the tourist spots. Karnataka is also called as city of gardens because of its lush green patches and colorful blossom all over the state. So, dear children, it's our duty to know the history of our state and famous natural resorts of our state and let's develop an attitude towards protecting them.